This week, let's watch a cat cry. This week, I want to talk about Prequel, a webcomic about a kaijit from the Elder Scrolls universe named Katia and her adventures as she makes a new life for herself. Prequel started as a fan adventure in the MS Paint Adventures forums when a creator under the name of Kazarad started it up and eventually moved it onto its own website when it became large enough. Now let's get into all the good stuff about it. Prequel has a variety of art styles as Kazarad has collaborated with other artists with video games, music, flash animations. This is an adventure style webcomic. If you want to add to it, please, there's a link on the website to submit commands and suggestions. And a lot of these elements have been included in the webcomic. And there is no need to worry about the established setting of the Elder Scrolls on top of this webcomic. It is a plus to have a familiarity with it, but it is not needed. And as a warning, this webcomic is currently on hiatus since Kazura finished up a Kickstarter and is sending everything out. Be sure to catch up with the archive and the side stories as we all wait for when he makes a huge update very soon as he finishes up his shipping out the Kickstarter loot. This adventure talks about Katia Morgan, a cat person from the Elder Scrolls universe, and as she's moved on to a new land to start a new life, and then everything goes wrong. For context, in her book it is considered a success to walk from one town to another without any trouble. One thing that really does interest me with this is how I consider this a great example of fair use. I'm really curious to see what Bethsaida would think of this webcomic, as Kazarad has been using their own source material to tell his own story. He has created his own character, he has created her own path through this world, and added to the lore behind it. Yes, there are monsters that take place in the Elder Scroll games like vampires and lizard folk and many, many more. But he has taken all of these elements and put it into its own adventure. He's not using the artwork of the games to tell the story. He's making his own. He's using and licensing music to tell the story with his own flash animations. And it's very cool to see what an example of proper fair use looks like. Personally, I see copyright at sometimes a necessary evil to something that is very terrible. But I don't understand why, like this, you can't let others use your creative ideas to create their own to add and build on to it and not just take from it. From what I know of fair use, you need to have a derivative work that does not influence the profits from the original work. And I believe this is true. It is a webcomic, it is creative, it adds onto the story, it is not a video game the same as The Elder Scrolls. Is it legal? I don't know, I'm not a lawyer. Is it good? Yes. Again, I'd love to see if anyone else who is watching this to leave a comment about what they think of this, if they have any suggestions. So please like, subscribe, comment, and enjoy watching a cat cry. Until next time.